Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Breen and I'm Jessica Bowman. An agreement between the Sioux City Community School District and the Bishop Heelan Catholic Schools to bus Heelan's elementary school students may end before the next school year. Yeah, we're talking about this busing agreement. It is one of several proposed cuts to the Sioux City Community School District fiscal year 2025 budget. KTV's Clayton Anderson has more tonight on this possible impact. Right now, the Sioux City Community School District provides busing services for elementary school students in the Bishop Healing Catholic Schools. But a budget proposal for fiscal year 2025 includes cutting the busing provided by Sioux City Community School District to the Bishop Healing Catholic Schools. If that happens, about 200 of Healing's 1,600 students would have to find their own way to school, but they would have help from the state. With the change in the agreement, the Sioux City Community School District will run four less bus routes because they will be no longer providing busing services for the parochial schools. Instead, they will be giving a reimbursement. That change still needs to be finalized. The Sioux City Community School District says it no longer has the staffing to continue to provide these routes. The district has 54 other routes it is required to service by law. An ongoing shortage of bus drivers have caused the district to have to contract some routes to the city of Sioux City's transit system. That costs the district money. Bottom line, it boils down to staffing. We're just uh, struggling to provide drivers for our 54 routes that we have for the public students. Um, to, to just provide staffing for that. So the biggest bottom line is, is the staffing need. Plus, we will see some budget uh, reduction on that as well. That change would leave the Bishop Healing Catholic Schools without busing because school staff say they wouldn't have the resources to provide bus service for the next school year. We don't have buses. We don't have a fleet of buses. It's not something uh, we have access to. And so if that were to go away, it would be very difficult for us, be very difficult for our students. Flannery says while Healan stands to see an increase in funds from education savings account vouchers from the state, the school system plans to use those dollars to raise teacher pay along with standard tuition increases. It's probably not widely known, but our teachers make between 65 and 75 cents on the dollar as to what our public schools in the area make. While officials with the Sioux City Community School District say they don't have the staff to fulfill the routes serving Helan students, Flannery says he has been in contact with the district to see if there is anything Helan could do to keep the busing partnership and help recruit staff. He says he is optimistic. In Sioux City, Clayton Anderson, KTIV News 4.